Hello you guys, it's Gratis and Latius and okay, I got everything set I believe. So um this one's gonna have pops. I believe I gathered all the pops that I got. I hope. <laughs> Let's see. Like I said, I believe I gathered everything. Uh okay, cause looking at this okay, cause it was like um, the only ones that are, like, cost more in Toys R Us is, of course, they're exclusives. Which is why I am so surprised, like, I don't, it surprises me that they even had the pops for their price, $10 to begin with. So, yes. Uh, which one did I buy first? Those. Let's show the lone one out actually. Okay, adjust here a little bit. All right, so I saw this pop, I don't remember exactly when, and I don't know when it was released, I think a few months ago. This is a, a, a um, a, you know, Hot Topic exclusive. And uh, my dad was going to buy it, but I told him, don't do that right now. Just wait until we, we were able to afford to buy it. And, um, you know, so sometimes I would check back and forth. Maybe not the whole time because... God damn it. I hate this underwear. <laughs> I swear, I really feel like I'm fat. <laughs> God damn. I know, unnecessary info, but hey, I'm... I don't care. <laughs> and at one point, when did I get this? I know it's been at least a month. So two months ago, two days two, will be 60 days ago. And then I saw like um, the Amazon price. I was like, uh oh, it went up to 50 bucks. Oh shit, I think I overweighted a bit too long. So. Luckily, I was able to get it then. So, yeah, I kind of should have got it the first time I saw it. I didn't think it would disappear like that because they had a lot of copies. But then again, I think that was a month later when I got it. So, here it is. The Neo Queen, Serenity, Small Lady, and King Endymion. I don't know if I said his name right. I'm pretty sure if I saw these letters in Japanese, I'd be able to say it a lot better. So I got Sailor Moon, Chibibusa, and Tuxedo Mask over there. Ah. Yep. So, um, interestingly enough, um, they actually, see, this was what makes no sense. They actually did not overprice it, because I'm pretty sure they could have priced it for it, because we know, we all know how topics is expensive surprisingly they only charge ten dollars a pop so that's very interesting <laughs> where are you guys did i say it? i don't know but these are so gorgeous by the way um i had no picking in these because this was a surprise a surprise from my dad so so far so good these are so gorgeous guys like I love these pops. This Sailor Moon pops are my favorite. I'm surprised they still have not even made Pokemon. I wonder why. Sorry, scratch your head. Ugh. Having dry skin causes scratching. So, again, these are so pretty. I love them. <laughs> I gotta say, um, between the special or limited edition, the Sailor Moon and these, I like these a lot. I'm only comparing the Hot Topic exclusive right now at the moment. So here's a TV Usa. Small lady. Something tells me they're going to absolutely make more Sailor Moon pops. And have to, they gotta include Helios in there somehow. Yeah. I don't know, but uh, looking through this. Seems good. Oh yeah, by the way, I've ha actually had these unboxed, so yes, I actually didn't wait until now to open them. God damn it. Don't fall on me. 
I love it, man. It's so pretty. That this is also shining gold too. And of course, Neo Queen Serenity herself. And looking at this, it seems my dad got a nice one again. So three out of three. Um, now that I look at him, it seems like she's the one that's like the biggest in size here. Why? I have no clue. Um, okay, first of all, if they were going for size, I'm pretty sure Tuxedo Mask would be uh, bigger in height than her. And obviously she's a kid. So obviously she's tinier. So I don't know why they made Sailor Moon uh, huge. Maybe because of her pigtails? I have no clue. But this is so pretty. Oh my god, I love the whole thing. For $30? And not overpriced? Oh my god, my fucking head is hurting. <laughs> Again, very gorgeous. Very beautiful. Love it, love it, love it. I love it. So pretty. And I guess I can use this box here. I can see my hairy arm too. Don't give a damn. Fucking hell, that looked like dominoes, man. Yeah, but I don't have enough room for the other ones. <laughs> All right. Oh, 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 how could I forget about this one? So, when Toys R Us obviously announced they're shutting down, the first time I went back to their store, because it was been it has been a while since I went there. At the time, the next time I returned was like the first time I stepped into the store when they having their obviously out of business discount sale at the time it was i gotta say i know they don't give a shit because they're losing their jobs but um the the signs are completely misleading i think it says something to the effect like everything it said everything 30 percent but clearly it wasn't because pops at the time i went it was only 10 percent off i believe and to my amazement i knew this was exclusive i didn't expect it to find it the last time i returned there was i think last week and they were all gone. I'm um, not surprised. Um, they actually had a lot of copies that day. And I must have went at the right time. I don't know when they disappeared. But uh, yes, to my amazement, I actually found this one. This one surprised the hell out of me when I found it. So, and for some odd reason, this goes with this set. I'm kind of surprised. Hmm, I'm surprised. I don't know. I thought this was made with the second set. Interesting. Seems like it's not. So, I got Queen Barrel. So, the only one that I'm missing in terms of Sailor Moon, if I'm not forgetting anything else, once again, will be the Comic Con. I think it is a Comic Con. Sailor V with her mask on exclusive. Sorry. I need to move my arm. It hurts. Because I'm holding the phone like that. Like, like this. So, it's gonna get tired here. Let me undust her, actually. Her hair reminds me, I don't know if you can hear me, reminds me of, uh, Twizzlers. <laughs> I don't really like Twizzlers that much. It, it kind of reminds me. I, know I need to do better dusting, but I can't spend a lot of time on that. But, uh, I made this one I picked with my own eyes and body there so yeah i made sure to pick up a good one and i think i did because like i said they had a lot of copies and i picked this one she's so pretty very very pretty even though she looks even like i said her hair looks like twizzlers it makes me want to chomp at her hair to be honest <laughs> and like i said it's not like i'm a huge twizzlers fan to begin with so this one, I don't think it's going to have extreme trouble standing. Yeah, I'm not surprised. The other ones might. So the same day, I I actually did not expect to. First of all, I didn't expect to get any pops because it's not like... Where are you guys? Um, I wanted to get any pop that I found, but apparently... Nino Kuni intrigued my interest. So instead of buying Queen Barrel... 
here. So if I bought them two, they had the other one, but the other two interested me the most. So, oh yeah, and by the way, I actually am looking for specific pops, which is my Heroes Academy, I believe, which is Deku, um, Light, Death Note, because yes, I actually did see Light in Toys R Us months ago, though. I had them in my hand, but they didn't have them this time. And I'm still looking for, uh, I had it in FYE in my hands, but I put it back, so yeah, that's like two strikes right there. Uh, Tokyo Ghoul, uh, Kaneki Ken, but no luck. I don't think Kaneki Ken is, or that particular pop that I saw is exclusive, so I'm not sure. So here's the, uh, I think he's the main character for Minokuni. And the other one, to be honest, the reason why I bought it is because it's Minokuni. It looks awesome, and uh oh, okay, the green one, the green little dude, and he reminds me of uh, oh no, I forgot his name. Motherfucker, for Full Metal Alchemist, is it Royce? No, Ro Roy, 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 yeah. <laughs> I think his name is Roy, so here it is. I know nothing. All I know is it's Nino Kuni, and I believe it's Bandai Namco, and I still remember to this day how they fucked up the... <sighs> oh yeah, I opened these two, that's why there's dust on them. I need to undust it. How they fucked up the limited edition to the first game to this day. <laughs> because of the distributor that they used, I believe. Oh god, that, that's horrible. <laughs> so this is gorgeous. Love it. And they came with little monsters. I don't know if they're like their companion, I assume. Or they summon them or they're with them. And that's just their little monster. So I hope I got the right one with the right one. Because the box shows them together there. So it doesn't have a mouth, by the way. So these are so cute. I think the only other pops that I have that have a little extra is... And I think his name is Artemis is it for sailor moon so sailor venus i should say and what's your name evan a very nice english name roland so roy's name is roland <laughs> oh and he and it pop looks amazing too looks like pokemon the little thing that comes with it all right so Here's Mr. Roland. I don't think uh, I, Roy from Full Metal Alchemist has a ponytail. No, he just has, I think, short, dark, black hair. I just said dark, black hair. Of course, black is a dark color. <laughs> so, I have three more minutes. I think I picked good pops because to be... Oh, 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 no. This is damage. Because, uh, I was going to say, now that I think about it, I don't think I actually tried to look for decent pops here. <laughs> the Queen Barrel, I think because I was so distracted with, I was in shock when I found Queen Barrel. I must have forgot to look at these two. Whoops. It happens, though, because when you get excited about something, especially finding that, I, I just lost track pretty much. So, here is, uh... Roland and oh they have names okay so the other one green is Higl Hig Higledy and Higledy. okay so they both have the same name interesting and I gotta hurry this up so I can put it all in this video and this one I got like last week I actually was kind of eyeing this for some odd reason I do have the pop I'm sorry the uh amiibo and I don't know why I wanted this one to be honest I wouldn't mind getting Chung Li too. This looks like Dragon Ball Z. But hurry up. I don't have more only than a minute. So yeah, I opened this right away too. So it's just the Sailor Moon from Christmas that I didn't open right away. So yes, this is Toys R Us exclusive. So it cost a little more 12 bucks. See what I mean? $12 and $9 pops. And and, and how topic price their pops. $10 a piece, Toys R Us. Now, to be honest... I think I tried to look for a decent one, and thank goodness it looks like I got another one. A good, a good decent one. I don't know what these words say. So yeah, I hope that you uh, enjoyed this video. I just literally showed you 7, 8, 9, 10. I think 10 pops since I've had December, I believe. So yeah, uh, next video. Oh, I have to figure it out. I think it's going to go back to video games. I don't know.
So, see you next video.